In a faculty recollection, the teachers were asked to share their thoughts of the learner. Teacher A said, the learner is a product of his environment. Sometimes he has no choice. He is determined by his environment. Teacher B said, the learner can choose what he can become despite his environment. Teacher C said, the learner is a social being who learns well through an active interplay with other. While Teacher D said, the learner is a rational being. Schools should develop his rational and moral powers. Whose philosophical concept is that of Teacher A? A. Rationalist. B. Behaviorist. C. Existentialist. Or D. Progressivist. The best answer is B. Behaviorist. Behaviorists believe that our responses to environmental stimuli shape our actions. Teacher B response comes from a A. Behaviorist B. Existentialist C. Essentialist Or D. Perennialist The best answer is B. Existentialist If you agree with Teacher C, you are a A. Perennialist B. Rationalist C. Essentialist or D. Progressivist. The correct answer is D. Progressivist. For progressivism, the aim of education is to promote democratic, social living, while placing focus on active and relevant learning. If you identify yourself with Teacher D, you adhere to what philosophy? A. Progressivist. B. Behaviorist. C. Existentialist. Or D. Perennialist. The best answer is D. Perennialist. Perennialists believe that the focus of education should be the ideas that have lasted over centuries. They believe the ideas are as relevant and meaningful today as when they were written. They recommend that students learn from reading and analyzing the works by history's finest thinkers and writers. Whose response denies man's free will? A. Teacher A. B. Teacher C. C. Teacher D. Or D. Teacher B. The correct answer is A. Teacher A. Behaviorism focuses on the idea that all behaviors are learned through interaction with the environment. And thus there is no free will.